okay, Dad? Oh, a lot better. You really scared me back there. Piper? What are you doing here? I'm visiting my father. This man is your father? Yeah. Glenn Reynolds, nice to meet you too. Nice to meet you too, sir. Originally was getting up to thank you for the $50. We can make that go a long way. But now I need to be thanking you for saving my life, apparently. The doctor said that you two were the main reason why he's still alive. You guys kept him stable. What happened to you back there? Well, I wasn't eating and I guess my body was running on fumes. And so, just couldn't keep up anymore. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. I. We could get you food if you want. We could go get you something. Oh, no, no. There's nothing you could get me that the hospital isn't already providing. Which is why you should probably get back to work. But I want to stay here with you. I know, but... This visit is gonna set us back a little bit. And so a full shift and some tips could really help us out. We can stay here. We can? Yeah, we, we can stay here. Jensen can give you his phone to, you know, be connected with your dad. I can? Yeah. I... Just be careful. I can't crack a fifth phone this year. Yeah, so now you're in like two places in one time. I can't believe that you guys are actually doing this for me. Uh, of course, I... We, we really like you, Piper. I save. Go ahead, go have a good shift, sweetie. I'll be right here. Remember, you could call us anytime. Let's go, I'll walk you out. I mean, I'm glad you're okay and doing well, so that's all that matters. Yeah. Uh, so. Oh, sorry, one sec. Oh, it's Piper. Hi. Hey, Piper. Sorry, I just really wanted to hear my dad's voice again. Oh, yeah, yeah, of course. Here, I'll put you on speakerphone. Hey, sweet pea. Hi. You doing all right? I'm really overwhelmed. We just take it one table at a time. Turns out, I'm doing pretty good. Doctor says I'll be out of here in no time. I want to tell you something. I'm proud of you. Honestly, that's all I needed to hear. Thanks, Dad. Anytime. See? Two places at one. Piper. Oh. Hello? Piper? That was... Weird. Why are you even on your phone at work? Sorry. Where were you? Why'd you miss your shift? I went to the hospital. You went to the hospital to look at a homeless man? <laughs> you don't know? Rumor is that that homeless hobo is Piper's dad. It's probably a good thing that that mess fell in the first place. She's probably been smuggling our food for him to dine and dash with on the side. That's pathetic. That explains so much. Did your father actually even fall? Yeah, obviously. Are you sure? Because it seems awfully coincidental that a big stunt like that happens, causes a huge commotion, and then suddenly all the money is missing from the register, and you were the only one unaccounted for. This is the first time I'm hearing about this. You know, I did see you run past the register on your way out. I rushed to get my jacket. I keep it under the register. I don't know what you guys are talking Piper, about. you're in a hard place, but you will not mock and take advantage of me in my place of business. <laughs> I don't mind to do anything. Hand over the money now, and we can handle this at the end of your shift. I don't have it. Get out. What? 
you're fired. <sighs> I'm sorry. This is literally all she had. Well, then she should have been honest. I better not see a scratch. I don't have insurance on the phone. Dude, let's just hope she's okay, all right? Hey, Jenna, where's Piper? Is she on her shift? She got fired. What? Why? For stealing from the register last night, but I don't think she did it. No, she didn't. That's not even like her at all. Can I talk to the manager? They're pretty convinced. Um... Um, excuse me, is your manager around? I have a video from the accident last night, and I really think he needs to see it. Yeah, I'll go get him. I was here last night, and I got this video of the man that collapsed, but look right here. Oh my god! Somebody! Somebody! Do you think he's gonna be alright? Emily! Yes? Do you care to explain this? Um, what? How could you steal from me and then let Piper take the fall? I, I can explain. Explain to the door. You're fired. Thank you, Ellie. I just, I feel terrible for what I said to Piper. I misjudged her and ran her off. Well, are you willing to give her her job back? It's the least I could do, but she's homeless. Who knows where she is now? Did you guys hear that? He said he can give her her job back. So, uh, now we have to find her. How? I don't know. She could be anywhere with my phone. Your phone? That's right. We can use your phone to locate her. If it's not dead yet. Wait, can I come? I mean, I think I can help Piper too. Of course, yeah. Let's go, guys. Let's go. Where is she? It says right here. It, is Piper? that Piper? Piper? What are you what are you guys doing? How did you find me? Through Jensen's phone. Which I'd like back, by the way. Guys, I really messed up. I lost my job and they think I stole the money, but okay, I didn't okay. and I can't get it. It's okay. Okay, we figured it out for you. It was Emily. She stole the money and put it on you since you're homeless. Emily? Oh, we talked to the manager and they feel absolutely terrible. They want you to come back for a sincere apology and your job, so. Really? Yeah. And Mr. Glenn, you two shouldn't be living in this car. My dad lives a block from the diner, and he said you and your daughter are more than welcome to stay in the guest house for a couple months as we get back, you know, on your feet. No, we couldn't impose. No, no, we insist. And we got it all ready for you guys. That's really amazing. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hi, Ver. You're special. And I wish people could see you the way I see you. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. <laughs> It's estimated that 2% of the world's population is homeless. 2% doesn't sound like much, but when you do the math, that's nearly 154 million people living on the streets, or somewhere they can't call home. People suffering from homelessness come in all ages, backgrounds, and looks. There could be someone you see every day, and you don't know that they don't have nowhere to call home. Be slow to judge. Happy holidays from the squad and I. Hospital scene two, coverage of left take one. We just take it one table at a time. Turns out, I'm doing pretty good. Doctor says I'll... <laughs> hey, Piper. 
Didn't even call you. <laughs> Slightly sweet to your right, Hunter. Right Sorry, side. I knew I missed it. Don't be nervous, relax! <laughs> My lips falling off. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, no. All right, let's go. Let's